Hey guys and welcome back to my channel after so damn long. Let's be honest. Cooking while you live by yourself is kind of lame. You make all this food and have no one to share it with. Meaning sometimes you eat too much or are faced with eating the same thing forever. There is no one around to help you clean up the mess in your kitchen after you put all this effort into preparing the meal and is exhausted and when you make something really good or delicious there is no one who can really care about it i speak this from my experience as a budget savvy lady who lives by herself i have no choice but to whip up meals at home and sit them for days but luckily i have learned how to make the best of being a solo chef although i am a big fan of meal prep i am also a huge advocate of being able to make something on the fly whenever i like it i love being spontaneous creative and resourceful with what i have in the kitchen the best way to master that is to discover your own easy set of standby ingredients you love that can be used a bunch of different ways i am all for watching a movie while eating dinner but i also increasingly love sitting down at my tiny place two person table and mindfully enjoying my meal that i have just made for me the two the words that exchange between the two of all that happened during the day of all that we are thinking of all the future plans that we are making of all the excursion of all the process that we require but then you realize that yes there is no one except you in this four walls but there is something that you cannot deny of there is peace in your life much better than the chaos outside in the world while enjoying the meal that you just made for yourself don't forget to blast some really good 90s hip hop or 20s music while doing the dishes so meaningly this was my story of cooking for myself while i live alone Do let me know in the comment section what is yours and let's see what is the common thing that all people living alone here or living far away from their family even if you live in your hostel in the college let's see what's the similarity between we both and what is the thing that we miss about being home bye bye